To use Galaxy AI on the Z Fold 6, start by opening Settings, then locate Galaxy AI. You need to be signed into Samsung for this. So this shows all of the AI features. I'll walk through them one by one. Starting with Call Assist, make sure this is on. So if I call someone, so I'm going to call someone right now, you're going to notice we have the Call Assist option. And so if we go to the live translate here, we can translate from one language to the other. So if I set this to English and German, what's going to happen is the call will be translated from English to German. And if I speak German, that will be translated into English. So I'll just hang up the call there. The next feature is the chat assist. So we'll tap on OK and chat translation will make that one on. And so if I go to the messages and I send someone a message, what we can do is we should see the AI button. If not, we'll tap this icon and we are looking for the AI. It's still not showing. We need to go to the Samsung keyboard for this. And there it is. So this is the AI. So we have chat translation which will translate the uh, language. So if I go from English to German, it should translate it. But it uh, seems not to be, but it should do. If I go out of here and go back in, we have the composer. So we could, um, you know, give it a prompt, like write a paragraph about, you know, stuff. So I made the prompt, write a paragraph about subscribing to Saundiverse. So we'll just generate this one. And there it is. Let me know if that's uh, convincing enough for you. And then we also have the writing style. So you can change your writing style to be like professional. And you have spelling and grammar check. And then we have the interpreter. So this is a standalone application. So if we open the interpreter app. So go to interpreter. Uh, this application It's kind of like Google Translate. You, know, you have this feature in Translate. So what it does, we'll select a language. So what happens is I'll start and I'll start saying things. And then when I stop speaking, it will translate it into German. So I'll translate it into German. After it's translated, the microphone will be on for the German so that they can speak. So you see it automatically turns on and it will translate that into English. So then it will translate that back. And so there you go. Now, if you open the uh, to the inside screen and you tap this icon here, what shows now is the translations are also showing on the cover screen. So if I just put the phone down, you know, I can see the translation here and then they can also see the translation on their end. So that's also quite helpful. You have the note assist and also drawing assist these two are linked. So we need to open the Samsung notes app and we'll create a new note. And so we see the AI here. So if I just do this, and then we go to the AI, we have the composer, which we saw earlier, you know, you write a prompt and it will you know, create a paragraph, etc. We can change our writing style, check the spelling and grammar. And then also, if I do a drawing, so I'm gonna do a drawing here, we can then select the AI button Okay, so select the AI button, and so we see sketch the image. We can tap on this one, trace around this, and generate. So let's have a look at what it generates. So we'll just patiently wait. And so it seems to have enhanced the smiley face. That looks quite nice. Good day to subscribe. And you also have the uh, other options, like formatting the note, summarizing it, and translating it all right there. Uh, don't don't mistake it with the keyboard. So I try and get the keyboard to show up. Don't mistake it with the AI button on the keyboard. Okay, so you need to tap the AI button here instead. Now we also have the transcript assist. So what this is is it enhances the AI inside of the voice recorder. So if we open the voice recorder app. And then we start a recording. So let's go through this and start a recording. So I'll do this quick one, blah, 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 blah. What it will do is it will now use AI 
to convert the transcription. Uh, so we'll get the speech into text. So we'll tap transcribe and we'll use English and it's going to transcribe it. And if the text is long enough, you'll get a summary as well. If you select the transcript, you can then tap the, uh, the translate button there if you would like to. We then have the browsing assist. So we need to uh, see summarize here and then translate. So if I go to a web page and I tap the AI button, we can summarize this web page and see what it's about. So it tells us that. And we can also translate the page if we would like to as well. We have photo assist, so we can use AI in the photos. So let's have a look at this picture here. And we'll tap the AI button for this. And so we'll just tap on OK. So what you can do is if you rotate the image, it will fill in the blanks. You can add images from your gallery and put them into your image. Just going to undo that and go in again. And then also we can do uh, the portrait studio. So I'll take a face and maybe make it look good. So if we generate that, it's going to generate in the style we want. So there it is, it's done this generation. Last time I did this, it made me look really, really fat, but seems to have done an okay job, I guess. So we'll go out of that one. You can also sketch the image. So I can add like some, a keychain, I guess, do like a, keychain let's see if that works so it seems to have added a beard interesting but <laughs> oh, shaving cream i guess but there you go it does work well well when it works it works well when it doesn't it does that garbage drawing assist is inside the notes and then ambient wallpaper this is ai wallpaper so from your settings if you go to the wallpaper and style you can then select the change wallpapers option and now we have the create with AI so we'll select the generative AI and then we'll choose let's say night and so you have this prompt and you tap generate and it will generate an AI wallpaper this is like an original wallpaper it like actually makes it itself um, so no one else will have that one and then finally we have the health assist so I can't show this, I don't have like a watch and stuff, but this will just you know, use AI to help with your health data and will give you some guidance on that. So hopefully this video helped. Thank you.